Hi everyone, so here is exercise 4.1 third question from the equation class 7th and the question here is solve the following equation by trial and error method and two questions we have given. So trial and error method means in place of P and here in place of M we have to substitute different values and see that in which value LHS and RHS are equal and for which it satisfy and that will be the solution of this equation. So let's try solving this. So here we have a solution. So we don't know for which value the LHS and RHS is equal. We have to substitute different values and check and that is what is called trial and error method. So we're going to take P is equal to 1. We're going to start with 1. It, it can be negative, it can be positive or it can be 0 also. So since I can see that the number is 17, so obviously the P has to be a positive number here. So let P is equal to 1 in that case. LHS will be here in LHS we have 5p plus 2 so it, it will become 5 into 1 plus 2 which is nothing but 5 plus 2 which is nothing but 3 right 5 plus 2 which is nothing but 7 but here on RHS we have 17 so therefore we can say that LHS and RHS are not equal here so LHS is not equal to RHS in case if P is equal to 1 so this is not a solution so let us take we'll take putting P value as 2 let's see what happens then LHS will be 5 into 2 plus 2 which is nothing but 10 plus 2 which will gonna give us 12 so obviously again in RHS we have 17 and LHS and RHS are not equal again here. LHS is not equal to RHS. And again, putting P value is equal to 3. Now LHS will be 5 into 3 plus 2 which is nothing but 15 plus 2 which is equal to 17. So here you can see LHS is equal to RHS. We had a RHS is equal to 17, both are equal. So therefore, P is equal to 3 is a solution. It is a solution of equation and that is 5P plus 2 is equal to 17. So this is how we have to substitute different values in given variable and we have to find out the answer. This was the first question. Let us take the second question now. So in second one, we have 3m minus 14 is equal to 4. Now let's start with m is equal to 1. So if m is equal to 1, then LHS is equal to 3 into 1 minus 14, which is nothing but 3 minus 14. We're getting answer in negative, which is minus 11. Whereas RHS is nothing but positive number, which is 4. So here LHS is not equal to RHS. Now obviously, if I'll take a next number as my 2, still I'll get 3 2s are 6 and 6 minus 14 is still negative number. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just increase my number, I'll change my m value as uh, 4 and I'll try it out. m is equal to 4 and let's see what happens. So LHS is 3 into 4 minus 14. So this is 12 minus 14, again still I'm getting negative number minus 2. So here LHS is not equal to RHS. Now what if I'll take 5? So if M is equal to 5, then LHS will be 3 into 5 minus 14, which is 15 minus 14, which is 1. So here LHS is not equal to RHS. And next, I guess for the next one, it's going to satisfy M is equal to 6. So LHS is 3 into 6 minus 14. So this is nothing but 18 minus 14 and we're getting answer 4. So here LHS is equal to RHS. Therefore, we can say that M is equal to 6 is a solution. Is a solution of given equation. 
or solution of equation and the equation is 3m minus 14 is equal to 4. So this is a trial error method. We don't know for which value it's going to satisfy. So you have to keep on substituting different values and try for one which can satisfy. I hope you have understood. In case you have a doubt or a question, you can drop a comment below. And thank you so much for watching.